Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to create this beautiful timeline infographic using PowerPoint. Let's get started. Let's first enable the guides and format the background with two step linear gradient. Change the direction and stop colors to light gray and white colors. Next go to insert tab and draw right arrow shape. Adjust its shape using orange color edit point and make it no outline. Change its fill color to any solid color of your choice. Next we will create shadow effect at the back end of this arrow shape. Go to insert tab and draw triangle shape. Make it no outline and flip it as per requirement. Adjust its shape and format it with two step linear gradient. Change the direction and change any one stop color to dark gray. Adjust the angle as shown and set white color gradient stop to 100% transparency. Add two more gradient stops to make this gradient evenly distributed across the shape. Now go to soft edges feature and increase its value until you get desired shadow effect. Adjust this shadow along the arrow shape as shown and send it to back. Next go to insert tab and draw circle over this arrow shape holding down shift key. Make it no outline and format it with two step linear gradient. Change the stop color to next darker shade of gray color and adjust its direction. Now duplicate the circle using Ctrl plus D and reduce its size holding down Ctrl and Shift keys. Make sure both circles gradient directions are opposite to each other and align them as shown. Next select both circles and apply outer shadow effect. Adjust its transparency until you get desired effect. Now select both circles and drag them holding down Ctrl and Shift keys to create a duplicate set. Next go to insert tab and draw rounded rectangle shape. Adjust its roundness using orange color edit point and send it to back. Format this shape with same two-step linear gradient, but change it to opposite direction. Also format its outline with two-step linear gradient and change their stop colors to white. Make sure right side stop color is set to 100% transparency. Also increase its outline width to two points. Next go to insert tab and draw rectangle shape between these two small circles. Make it no outline and fill it with white color. Now select all these shapes and drag them holding down Ctrl key to create three more duplicates. Mm -hmm. 
Adjust the arrow shape if required. Align all circles horizontally and adjust the rectangle size accordingly. Next union this rectangle shape with two small circles and bring them to front. Select all rounded rectangle shapes and apply outer shadow effect. Adjust its transparency, size and blur values. Finally add all text fields and PNG icons onto our design. So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.